Hello everyone, it's me JB from Enic Tutorials. Today in this video I will show you how to install any icons and themes in Ubuntu. So without further more delay, let's begin. So before proceeding, we need to install some applications. So for this just press Ctrl Alt T to open the terminal. So in the terminal, we need to type some commands to install some needed applications which we'll need in the later part of this video so we have to install it firstly so just type sudo apt install genome dash cell dash extension so you need to type this command after typing this command just hit enter Type your computer password, hit enter. So in my case I have already installed this application so if you have not installed then you proceed the installations. So after installing this first application you need to install some more few more applications. So now you need to type sudo space apt space install space genome dash tweak dash tool you need to type this command and after typing this command just hit enter as I have already installed this also so it's showing I uh, already in the newest version so if you have not installed it firstly then proceed with the installation and there is last more one more application you need to install so just type again sudo space apt space install space genome dash sub minus so i need to type this command and hit enter so it's saying depends the tree done reading standing permission done so i've already installed this too so it's not going to install it again so in your case if you're installing for the first time it will definitely install you in your Ubuntu computer so our first setup is everything is done now before proceeding I would like to mention that here I will show you two ways how to install the icons and themes back in your Ubuntu so the first process will use the terminal so once again just open ctrl alt T so just use this command sudo apt install space now you need to type your the icon pack names or the themes so you must know firstly what is the name of that icon pack or the theme so for this just find out in the google search to find out what is the name of the respective theme that you want to install it so in my case I want to install a papyrus theme so I will just type papyrus dash icon dash theme in your case it might be different so just firstly check out and find out the icon pack or the theme name before installing using this terminal so in my case I will be going to install a papyrus icon theme so I have typed such kind of name so in your case the icon or the theme name may be different so firstly check out by searching it in the google search so after that just hit enter type your computer password wait for a few seconds so it's downloading the icon pack and after downloading it will automatically get installed in your ubuntu computer so wait for a few seconds until the final installation is done so finally the icon and the theme pack have been installed successfully so this is the first way by which you can install the icons or the team packs in your Ubuntu now in the second process what you need to do you need to download some zip files or any tar files so for this just head over to one website by opening any web browser so you can see this website genome dash look dot org so here you will find a tons of icons and theme packs for your Ubuntu computers so you can see on the left side and on the right side you can see here lots of 
newly added icon or team packs so I'll just select a full icon team packs you can choose any one so it will display the newly added and the old available icon packs so let me select one icon pack from here so uh, I'm going to download this delight icon pack so I will just click on it now it will preview the icons of this respective icon pack so you can see how it looks once you just apply it so these are the icons that is available under this pack so you can see on the right side download just click on it now you will see a tons of options to download right so if you want to just lead download a one file just like delight yellow then you can just download this file if and if you need the wallpaper exactly shown in the preview of this icon pack then you can download the wallpaper also so what i will do i will download almost every package which is below here you can see delight.jip so i'll just click on it now you can see here uh, a download option you can choose any of the download link i'll just select the first one wait for a few seconds so I'll firstly now download so wait for a few more seconds until the complete downloading is completed finally the icon pack zip file has been downloaded so let me go to the folder where it is being downloaded so you can see your zip file right so just double left click it to extract the file click on extract So the file has been extracted so you will be able to see your two different folders so let us open this so when you see this kind of numericals in the folders that means these are icon packs but if you see something different then it indicates it might be a team also so how to uh, install this kind of folder icons or any gif icons so for this what you need to do so let me open one more window and let me show you side by side so that you can understand clearly so on the left side I will just choose a home folder right you can see here I've selected a home and before proceeding you can see your three dot icons on the top right just click on it and you can see one option so hidden files just enable this option now we'll see the hidden files now here you will see one folder name as dot local just select it and just open this folder just open this share folder again now under this folder you can see a tons of folders and here you can see uh, icons so you might be able to see this icons folder already created and just you need to create one more folder if you want to apply your teams then just create a teams folder and if you don't see this folder just right click and create a new folder and give a name as teams now after that what you need to do on the right side you can see I have a icon pack so if it is a team packs then what you need to do you need to copy and you need to paste it under this folder on the respective teams but if you have a icon packs then you need to copy this respective folder on the icons folder so I'll just copy this I'll just open this icon folder so you can see I have some icon folders in my icons folder so I'll just click on paste but for a few seconds so you can see it's copying so finally the copying of this folder has been completed now we can close both the window now how to apply this icons right so on the starting of the video we have installed some applications right so you can move your cursor to this show applications and just click on it and open the all applications and now in the search you can just type and search tweak you can see here just open this now you can see it's the general reference now on the left side you can see your appearance right just select it now under the appearance you can see a tons of options so here you can see icons so right now 
the icon pack which I'm using is a fluent icon pack so when you click on it you will see the tons of icon packs which I have installed in my Ubuntu computer now just recently we have added a delight icon pack right just let us check it and now you can see the icon packs have changed so you can see here we have changed to the selected icon pack which we have installed right now or copied in the respective icon folder right now and you can see here if you want to change the applications also when you apply your teams then you can see a tons of teams to change depending upon your needs you can change the teams of anything say I'll just try to change a team so you can see when you change the cell or application teams it will just change to the default or respective selected teams so this is how you can install any icons and themes in Ubuntu and after that how you can apply it on your respective Ubuntu computer. So if you find this video tutorial useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching.